Hey, right, let me get Baruch chapter 2. We we'll start at 30. Ready? Ezekiel chapter 39, 23. Yeah. Bring it out. And the heathen shall know that the house of Israel went into captivity for their iniquity. So you see these signs, brother? See the signs? Look at the signs. Pay close attention, brother. Read okay. it again. And the heathen shall know that the house of Israel went into captivity for their iniquity. See, who went into captivity? Israel. So Israel went into captivity. Okay? This was, oh, but you see on this sign right here is captivity of the so-called Black Hispanic and Native Americans, oh, right? Y'all see that? Me. Read it again. And the heathen no. shall know that the house of Israel get that, get that went song. into captivity for their iniquity yeah. because they transgressed. Sorry. Because they trespassed against me. Right. We trespassed against the Most High God. This is why you see these acts happening to us. Right. Because we, we went against the Most High God. Okay? What y'all want to know, man? We just wanted this path through, but we didn't want to be disrespectful. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yep, go ahead. Go ahead, finish that off. Therefore, hide I my face from them. Go up a little bit so he can get that. Hold on, y'all pay attention. And the heathen shall know that the house of Israel went into captivity for their iniquity. So we went into captivity because we went against God. This is why this happened. Watch this. Because they trespassed against Because we trespassed against the Most High God. Watch this. Therefore, hide I my face from them. So he hid our, his face from us, man. That's why this happened to us. He took that, he took that armor off us, man. Okay? He took that protection off us. Where people like them can do this to us. Okay, Rick? And gave them into the hand of their enemies. And they gave us where? Into the hand of okay. their enemies. They gave us where? Into the hand of their enemies. They gave us where? Into the hand of their enemies. We were given into the hands of our enemies, man. Not our friends. Okay? Your friends don't kill you. Your friends don't murder you. Your friends don't take you captive. Only your enemy would do such acts. Words. Okay, finish that off. So fell they all by the sword. So they what? So they all. Like, so fell they all by the sword. So fell they all by the sword. Read. According to their uncleanness and according to their transgressions have I done unto them. Right. And I hide my face from them. So he hid his face from you, so called black, Hispanic, and Native Americans. Continue on. Therefore, thus said the Lord God, now. Will I bring again the captivity of Jacob? So he says, now will he bring again the captivity of Jacob? Bring us out of the captivity. That's right. Read and have mercy. And he will have mercy. He's about to bring us out of captivity. And now he's about to have mercy on you so-called black Hispanic brothers. Watch this. And I will have mercy upon the whole house of Israel. Right. And will be jealous for my holy name. Right. Read. After that. After that, they have borne their shame. Continue. And all their trespasses, where, whereby they have trespassed against me. Right. When they dwelt safely in their land. So these are all the trespasses that we did against the Most High God. Okay, we, when we dwelt slave safely in the land of Israel, man. Okay, we was breaking God's laws. According to Deuteronomy 28, verse 1, he said we will be blessed if we heart above all nations. That's right. That's right. Verse 15 says, we'll be cursed if we did not hearken. That's right. Okay? So this is the curse which was spoke about in prophecy. Right. Okay? Why we will put be get it to our enemies? Because we transgress against the most high God. We got more on that? Yeah. And none made them afraid. God. Uh, start at uh, 30, God. It's the book of Baruch, chapter 2, verse 3. No. For I know that they would not hear me. It says what? For I know that I knew that they would not hear me. It says, for he knew that they would not hear him. Because it is a stiff-necked people. You see these people out here, man? Y'all so stiff-necked. Y'all don't care about God. Y'all don't care about his laws. Huh? Y'all don't care about his son. Y'all don't care about his chosen? Right. You know what you care about? You love the damn white man. Yes. You love him. Huh? Read 
Where? In the land of their captivity. Where? In the land of their captivity. We in the land of our captivity, man. Huh? And y'all mad. Y'all brought this over here. That's right. Where? Man, but guess what? What does what the scripture say? What the scripture say? The scripture say that the spirit shall bear witness. That's right. That brother say he was dead. Man, his, his spirit told that he wasn't a ghetto, man. He going against the so-called his own brothers. He told us to go back to our land. That brother ain't never told the Indian, I mean the, the Europeans to go back to their land. That's right. You see what I'm saying? They the ones that came over and put the people on reservations. But you gonna tell us, your brothers, to go back to our land, to Africa. Right? Bro, you know how bad we want to go back to our land? That's right. Do you not know? This is the reason we out here. Everybody look to the east. That's right. Okay? That's where we go. That's right. We going back to Israel, baby. Okay? We don't care about Africa. Oh, we want to go back to our motherland. Right. Okay, the land of the Israelites. Right. Okay, land of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. That's right. Okay, the land of the righteous of the righteous, man. That's right. That's right. Okay, what, what we call the promised land. Right. Cause this land ain't promised to everybody. Okay. What we got, man? They should remember themselves. Man, in the land of our captivity. They should remember themselves. Hey, sister, the Bible says in the land of your captivity, you shall, you shall, remember, you shall remember yourself, That's man. Right. You're not so-called black. You're not an African-American. It says in the land of your captivity, remember yourself, sister. That's right. You're an Israelite. That's, That's right. right. That's right. Bring it out, huh? This is the book of 1 Kings, chapter 8, verse 47. Yet if they shall bethink themselves in the land whether they were carried captive. What? Yet if they shall bethink themselves in the land whether they were carried captive. And repent. And what? And repent. And what? And, and repent. repent. And what? And repent. And what? And repent. And what? And repent. And what? And repent. Hey, y'all black Hispanic and Native Americans, the Bible said, repent. Yes, right. Read on. And make supplication unto thee in the land of them that carried them captives, saying, We have sinned and have done perversely. We have committed wickedness. That's right. And so return unto thee with all their heart and with all their soul. Man, y'all got to return into the Most High Yahweh by Shiva Mashiach and That's right. Y'all must return. That's right. Y'all must bethink themselves. You must remember. Read. In the land of their enemies. In the land of our enemies. Which did, which led them away captive. Who led us away captive? In the land of our enemies. Our enemies led them away captive. Right. Which led them away captive. That's right. And pray unto thee toward their land. And pray unto their land. Which that gave it to their fathers. Right. Which that is to the east. That's right. The city which thou hast chosen. Huh? And the house which thou hast built for thy name. Then hear thou their Then hear thou their prayer and their supplication in heaven, thy dwelling place. Right? And maintain their cause. Right? And forgive thy people that have sinned against thee. Right? And all their transgressions. Wherein they have transgressed against thee. Right? All the trust uh, transgressions. But he have transgressed against me. Hey, brother, you mind if I pass you out of flight real quick? Appreciate you, brother. Go ahead, go ahead. Oh. Kwame Yasharada, brother. Kwame Yasharada. Hey, man, what we out here doing today? We out here teaching who we are according to the Bible, brother. You believe the Bible? You sure? Let me ask you a question. You mind coming up here, brother? Oh. Appreciate you, appreciate you. Here's a guy here, brother. What's your name? Eric. Eric. We are the Israelites, man. All right? According to the Bible, okay, we fit a prophecy that no other nation fit. That's right. Okay? And guess what? The Bible says we are his chosen people. That's right. And that's what we come out to do, to wake up our people. Not everybody, but our people. Right. Okay? Now, you know who Jesus Christ is, right? Now, do you know who Jesus Christ comes for? 
You don't. You do, but you do believe in him, right? All right, I'm gonna show you something real quick. I'm gonna show you who Christ come for. All right? Let me get Matthew 15, 24. All right? Now, brother, what we gonna show you is gonna be the most valuable thing that can ever happen to you in your life, man. Okay? Because this is the most degrading and worst thing that happened to you. Would you agree? And this happened because of what you don't know yet. Okay? And we're gonna show you. What you think about that, brother? Say it loud. That's fucked up, but we agree. God. Read that out. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 15, verse 24. What he answered and said, I am that sent, but unto the lost sheep, sheep of, of the house, house of Israel. Israel. Read again, everybody. Uh -huh. I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep, sheep of the house of Israel. Of Israel. So Christ said out of his own mouth that he is not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Yes. You see what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So do that mean the whole world? Did it say the whole world I was sent for the whole world? <laughs> Read it again. Matthew 15, 24. But he answered and said. But he answered and said. What did Jesus say? I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. See, he said he was only sent for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Which I'm a proof that you lost right now, brother. Because you're That's right. Mark. What you got, huh? This is the book of Luke. Chapter 1 and verse 68. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he has visited and redeemed his people. One more time. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. Of everybody. Blessed be the Lord God, God of, of Israel. Israel. So you see what he said? He said, blessed be the Lord God of Israel. You see what I'm saying? Read. For he has visited and redeemed his, his people. people. He was visited and redeemed his people, right? So now I'm about to show you who his... Who, who, I'm going to show you what Christ, what, what uh, nationality Christ was according to the Bible. Because it says his people, like your people. What, if I said, who is your people, would you say the white people are your people? No? So that's, that's how we try to say when he says he has visited and redeemed his people, he's talking about his people, not the world. Read that. 4 and 6. It's the book of Hosea, chapter 4, verse 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. See, he says, my people, you see what I'm saying? Like your people. He says, my people, the Israelites, what? Are destroyed for lack of knowledge. See, they destroyed for the lack of knowledge because they didn't have no knowledge. In, in slavery, we couldn't even read, right? Or write. We had the lack of knowledge. Watch it. I'm going to show you the prophecy, read. Because they are receiving not knowledge. Appreciate y'all, man. They rejected knowledge. Look. See, look, brother, I'm going to show you something. The Bible is telling you, speaking to you right now, brother. Yeah. Watch this. Read it again. Because they are Start from the top. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. See, brother, we know who you are, but you don't know yet. And we're trying to give it to you. And the Bible is speaking to you word for word right now. Read it again. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. So the Bible says his people, brother, are destroyed for the lack of knowledge, which you are included in. Read. Because they has rejected knowledge. Because they reject knowledge. Just how you tried to walk out, brother. It's nothing better than finding oh, out. Girl, I know, but guess what? It's a, knowledge, a lot of knowledge you got to... Today's God's holy day. God said just go buying, selling, or anything on the day. You see what I'm saying? We made the earth in six days and on the six, seventh day he rested. So if you believe in God, what makes you more greater than God who created everything and he rested on the seventh day? And today's the seventh day of the week right now. That's how we out here. And nobody out here has going to do no wickedness, man. We're about to wake up our people, man, until the sun go down. When that sun go down, we're going back and do what we got to do. But right now, brother, you got to go do sin, brother that you don't know you got to do yet. So that's why I was trying to show you. We're trying to show you who you are. It's going to be the most valuable thing you could ever get in your life. Because if you keep telling, going into sin, brother, you're going to, you're going to go into uh, wickedness. You're going to, you ain't going to make it to the kingdom. You see what I'm saying? Let me get, uh, let me get uh, Matthew uh, 15, uh, 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 5 to 17, man. Yeah, I'm going to show you something, brother. I got you. I know you got to go, bro, but I got to give you this. Three. Isaiah chapter 1, verse 3. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib. Well, these two dumbass animals, man. The ox is a dumb animal, and a jackass is a um, animal, right? But watch what it say. But Israel, read it again. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib. So the ox know his owner. He know who he belongs to, and the ass know where he belongs, where his land is. Watch this. But Israel doth not know. So where you from, bro? 
the point. You saw, I'm sure you how you fit pop pops. You, know? you can walk off and this is what the Bible trying to give you. That said the Lord right now. All right, let me get Jeremiah my 17 people and 4. Does not consider. See, yo, my people, you, you ain't considered. You gotta consider, brother. Yeah, man, whatever you about to do, about to go do, it's gonna be there, I promise you. Right. But you ain't no telling what's gonna happen if you don't get this word, you get killed by the white man tonight. And then you don't get your blessings, brother, because you never got the gospel. You never got your faith built up. Read, huh? And thou, Jeremiah 17, 4, and thou, even thyself, shall discontinue from thine heritage. Read it again. And thou, even thyself, shall discontinue from thine heritage. What's your heritage, brother? See what I'm saying? Read. That I gave thee. Read. And I will call thee to serve thine enemies in the land. How'd you get over here? Slave ship? No. How'd you get over here? Slave ship? And would you say you in the land of your enemy, right? Read that part again. And I will, and I will cause thee to serve thine enemies. Cause you to land. serve your enemies in the land. Which thou knowest not. Which we knew it not. We came from the west coast of Africa, read. For ye have kindled a fire in mine anger. Because we kindled a fire in his anger. We broke the law, statutes, and the commandments. Right. He said if we did that, we was going to be sent, uh, 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 serving another nation, man. You see what I'm saying? And that's what happened. Look, we served another nation. That's prophecy. We're going to show you, brother. But you don't know. The Bible says you have been discontinued from your heritage. Appreciate you, So who are you, brother, before you leave? I don't know. You don't know? And you're cool with that? No, not really. You don't want to know? Find out, brother. Yeah, contact, like, hey, contact the numbers on that flyer, man. You have to find out. Get this is the shirt. problem, man. Let's, let's go back to Hosea 4 and 6, man. It's sad, right? Yeah, man. It's sad, man, that that brother admitted to all the prophecies, right? He worried about that box. Yeah, he worried about that. Yeah. 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 This is the book of Hosea, chapter 4, verse 6. My people are destroyed. We're left with knowledge. Yeah, that brother sat here, and he just, okay. Okay, y'all gotta go, man. Y'all okay, I heard, all right, all right, the Sabbath day is cool. All right, hey, get the law, statute, and the commandments. All right, I found out. And what I, what I tell the brother, what I tell him, I say, man, you probably go off and get killed by the white man, right? And that's probably what's gonna happen, man. Let me get Matthew 15, uh, 5 and 17, man. Go ahead. Book of Matthew, chapter 5. Bring it out. 5 verse 17. Think that, think not that I have come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. That's right. For verily I say unto you, till heaven and earth pass, one jot or one tittle shall in no wise pass from the law, till all be fulfilled. That's right, man. Till all be fulfilled, man. So we gonna keep these laws, statutes, and the commandments. Thus said the Lord. Who? Oh. All right. Somebody got this up? I don't know who I yelled at, but somebody already yelled. They got my shit hurt. <laughs> bring it out! Bring it out! Bring it out! Bring it out! Book of Proverbs, chapter twenty-eight, verse nine. He that turned his ear away from the hearing of the law, even his prayers should be an abomination. Right, Whatsoever right. causes the righteous, the righteous to go astray. Evil way, he shall fall himself into his own pit, but the upright shall have good things in possession. Man, that's right, man. You see these brothers out here, man, play the camera, man. These some upright brothers, man. Okay? That's right. Oh, 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 why was your antennas when they was trying to take us to jail? Yeah. <laughs> they was over there got the on us. Yo, what's going on, y'all? You know what? You know what Right. Where was your antennas when they, was, they had us in slavery? Huh? Huh? Right. <laughs> <laughs> bring it out. First John, chapter 3, and verse 4. Whosoever committed sin, transgressing also the law, for sin is the, the transgression, transgression of the law. law. That's right. Are y'all looking at damn chocolate color Edomite right here? Yeah, uh, <laughs> yo. 
Hey, bring that out. Hey, listen, listen. Bring that out. Listen, the scripture says, right, a man is wise who can rule his tongue. That's right. Right? So that, that's nothing. You understand? Right. Then he crossed the line. That's his head. Right. You know what I mean? Right. But all that talking that don't mean nothing. He's a coward. He's a gangsayer. And that dude don't move nothing. Man, let's get back to these That's right. right. Stauffer. Bring it out. This is the book of Deuteronomy. Chapter 28, verse 4. So the man, so that the man that is tender among you. See that brother? He tender. tender man. That's a tender brother. <laughs> tender boot and read and bury. He tell you. His eyes shall, shall be evil towards you, bro. Evil towards Hold on, hold on. Read from the top. So that the man that is tender among you. That brother is tender. Y'all saw it with your eyes, man. Read. And very delicate. And he's very delicate, man. He's soft. Okay, he's effeminate. Right. He's emotional. Right. Okay, he can't control himself. That's, That's right. Right. Read. Right. His eyes shall be evil towards his brother. His eyes shall be evil towards his brother. He over here shooting us because we coming out the fight. Right. Okay? He calling us bitches because we coming out the fight. Right. Right. Okay? Read. And towards the wife of his brother. His bosom. And towards the wife of his bosom. I bet he be at home slapping his wife stupid. Okay? Calling all types of thoughts. All types of hoes. Okay? Read. And towards the remnant of his children, which he, he should leave. And he gonna be evil towards his children. He ain't got no order. He ain't got no discipline. Right. Uh, that's right. Okay? He can't, he can't even all control himself. Right. That's Look right. at him. He that's walking right. back up on us. Look at him. Nobody, nobody yeah, address him. Yeah, yeah, nobody address him. Don't address him. Don't address him. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Hey, Let's see if you're going to run up again. Real talk. I ain't got Let's no heart. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's see if you're going to run up again. Let's and you don't do like a wicked man. Let me you step back. You think I'm a bitch? You can step down and get your ass whooped. That's what I'm about. That's what I'm about. That's what the fuck I'm about. Y'all boys protecting y'all. Y'all boys protecting y'all. Y'all boys protecting y'all. This is my block. I work here. Well, but I'm saying, if you don't agree with me, what y'all thought you don't want to be a problem over here. Y'all don't want to be a problem. I guarantee you. I guarantee you. What you gonna do? One hand laid. One hand laid. You walked over here. You're a fucking coward. You walked all the way over here. Stop. You won't wake up. You will not wake up. You will not wake up. You won't wake up. You won't wake up. You won't wake up. God damn it, talking about one hit. Nigga, you won't wake up. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. We're not going to go into a church and have a preacher on the pulpit acting a motherfucking fool. I don't give a fuck about what you preach about. You piss the preacher off, they know how to handle that shit. God. Hey, hey, why are you doing? You're my, why are you doing that job? <laughs> read, 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 read. Bring that out again, huh? <laughs> Proverbs chapter 9, verse 7. He that rebuke a scorner, get it to himself saying. And he that rebuke a wicked man, get it himself a blood. Right. Reprove that a spawner. Right. Now she right. hate thee. That's right. Reprove a wise man, and he will love thee. That's right. Give right. instruction right. to a wise hey. man, and he will That's yet be wiser. Up in, man. Foul in, man. Foul in, man. We out here. We gonna protect one another at all times, man. Hey, slide oh, over just come a on, little bring bit. It, uh, bring slide over a little come bit. Out. Yeah. Bring the signs down. Yeah. Who's teaching, man? Who's teaching? Come on, bring it out, everybody. Go ahead. Bring that back out, buddy. Proverbs chapter 9, verse 7. He that reproveth a scorner, get it to himself shame. Right. And he that rebuketh a wicked man, get it to himself a blood. So we're going to rebuke a, a wicked man, right? That's what we was trying to do. Continue on. Reprove not a scorner. So the scriptures say reprove not a scorner, man. We ain't to correct that dude, man. Okay? He's going he gonna to stay in his wickedness. Oh, as right. you see, man. Okay, we coming straight out the Bible. Wow. Something that he hates. So we can't we can't reprove him. We can't give him instructions. Read. Lest he hate thee. Right? Rebuke a wise man. So we gotta rebuke wise men. We would correct wise men. 
when we show y'all that y'all going off, one of your wise men gonna take word. Gonna take you, man. Okay, not a scorner. Okay, Reed. And he will love thee. Man, and he gonna love us, man. A wise man, when he get reproved, get instructed to be corrected, he gonna love you, man. That's that's love. Reed? Give instruction to a wise man. Say what? Give instruction to, to a, a wise, wise man. man. Not to a dummy. Give instruction, instruction to, to a wise man. man. The Bible says give instructions to a wise man. Okay? That's right. So that's what we got to do as Israelites. Read. And he will yet, and he will be yet wiser. Right? Teach a just man, and he will increase in learning. So we got to teach, uh, teach these just men. All right? Y'all the ones that's going to increase in learning, man. Right. Y'all the one that's going to listen to the voice of the Lord thy God. Okay? Not these other nations. Okay? And the reason why the brother got mad, and this this is the bear witness, she was here other, earlier. She has uh, so-called mixed kids, right? You're the same person, right? But that brother that just came up here, out of his own mouth, he is a white boy. Okay? Just like your son. I don't care about color. Uh, you don't have to care, but does God care about it? No. How, why did he make it then? Right. Why did he make a dog and a cat? What? Right, because they yeah. matter. That's no. proof they matter. We are what we are. That's right, and you are who you are, and I am who I am. That, why, if, that, if that's not the case, why did he not make us all the same? Right. Because we have free will. How long? But that don't make sense. That don't make sense. <laughs> if, if, if it doesn't, oh, wow. listen, if it doesn't matter to God, why did he make your skin your color and my skin my color? Right. You telling me God didn't think at all when he made you? He made all of us in his image. Can you show me that in the scripture? And, and what did it say about how Adam was created? How was Adam created? Genesis. 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 What was the form of how he was created? Out of dirt. Well, what color is the dirt? Depends on where you're at. Hold on. You telling me you went somewhere on the earth. Second Ezra 6. There's white dirt. Black dirt, there's, yeah, there's red dirt, there's all kinds of different Right, dirt. right, right. But we know, yeah, if you go grab some miracle grow, right? That's fertilizer, right? To grow things. What color is it? All right, I bet. All right, since you want to, let's get scientific, scientific right quick. Ain't no red people, right? <laughs> so, hey, red dirt. You can't. We, we come about people, right? We and, got, we got, we got red people. You feel okay. me? As far as y'all, who we'll call y'all still white, but y'all not white. This white. Man, if you white. Yeah, that's because you're just you not know. trying to see it. Yeah, that's because. What color is your shirt? Then? What color is your friend face right now? Red it is. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Oh, that, that, that's that red there right there. My fault. That's that red there. Why, why are you focusing on color and not love? No, you you said that God you said that. No, you try to discredit it. that you try to discredit no, what God created. That's the point. And we wasn't talking about color. You said that God doesn't care about color. But he made them everywhere. How is that possible? That's like void. That doesn't it's like why would he make something that didn't matter to him? That's all I'm saying to you. You said that just it's not color, sister. You tripping? Yes, agree that color matters. You don't have a favorite color. <laughs> what color is that top you got on? We we done with her. We done with you. This is the why we can't deal with the world because y'all are so wicked. You say that God created something, but it didn't matter. Right. My skin don't matter, right? Love is what matters. What is love according to the Bible? All the same. What is love according to the Bible? Good question. What is love according to the Bible? It is kind. It is it's not proud. It's got, not boastful. I got it. You got, you got it. it. Corinthians. This is the book of First John. Let's hold you to your words. We're gonna leave. We're gonna read that the Lord. Let's see what love is. Love is not proud. It's not boastful. It's kind. This is the book. This is the book of First John, chapter five, verse three. For this is the love of God. For this is the love of God, sister. Yeah. You ta you're talking about love right now, right? You can't pick one over the other. I'm going to scripture. What about Corinthians? Go ahead. That we keep his commandments. What's the love again? That we keep his commandments. Read from the top so she can hear it. For this is the love of God. The Bible says, the Bible says, this is the love of God. What's the love of God? Read it again. For this is the love of God. 
that we keep his commandments. commandments. Sister, will you keep and his commandments? And his commandments are not grievous. All the commandments, sister. Which one are you pointing out right All now? All of them. Oh. Which one? Well, they always got a 600. Six There's 10 of them. Never in no, it's not 10 laws. Hold on. She's breaking it down. So, hold on. It's 10 laws. Is it 10 laws? Those commandments are Old Testament. Oh, Give me, hold on. Matthew 5 and 17. You're preaching out of the New Testament. I'm about to go to the New Testament. The New Testament. The Old Testament. I'm, I just did. She just, can't, she just canceled it out. This is the book of Matthew. Corinthians hold on. Is just five. Love is kind, not boastful. Hold on. Is Matthew in the New Testament? You're not one of those. Is Matthew in the New you want Testament? To have a dialogue, have a dialogue. Is Matthew in the New Testament? So it's Corinthians. Watch this. This is, this is Christ's word. Read. Matthew chapter 5 verse 17. Think not that I have come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am come not to destroy, but to fulfill. So Christ said he come not to destroy, but to fulfill. Okay? You're talking about the Old Testament. Uh, you got it. <laughs> huh? Oh, who had that verse? Proverbs chapter 28, verse 1. The wicked flee when no man pursue it. What? The wicked flee when no man pursue it. What? The wicked flee when no man pursue it. So y'all next? Your family's next? Y'all going one off next when we start reading the Bible? Right. Y'all believe That's the Bible right. as a family? The That's what we about to bring out. So I don't want y'all calling no police. When right. I read, just said the Lord. Right. I don't want you getting in your feelings. I'm going to read what Christ said, okay? Read Matthew 15 24. Are y'all are y'all uh, Israelites? Followers of Jesus. Man. Are y'all Israelites? We're followers of Jesus. Are you, hold on. The Bible says, let your yeas be yea and your nays be nay. Are y'all Israelites? Are you Israelites? Yes. 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 And how are you Israelites? Because oh. of Bible. Because I stem from the lineage of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yes. Yes. Okay? So I'm gonna ask you a question. A are you an Israelite? Spiritual Israelite. So can you show me? Can I show you a spiritual Israelite in the Bible? Can, oh, can you show me? Sure. Go ahead, pull it out real quick. Please. Give me uh, Matthew 15 and 24. Matthew chapter 15, verse 24. But he answered and said. What he did? What do what? But he answered and said. But Christ answered and said. Watch what he say. I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So the Bible says he is not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Word. Okay? So Christ is only for the Israelites. That's yes. Okay? And, and, and waiting for, I'm waiting to see if you can show me where the physical, uh, 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 the spiritual Here. Israelite is. By Galatians 6. Okay, now, get Galatians 6, somebody? Yep. All right, read Romans line. Go ahead. Romans, Galatians 6. I got you. Go ahead. Read it, read it for us. We come from Zach. Verse. I guess he just wants the whole chapter. I want to know which gate. I want to know which gate he goes into. Revelation 21 12. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>